also tonight, Allentown Mayor Ed Pulowski and former Reading Mayor Vaughn Spencer are facing federal corruption charges. The government unsealed an indictment against the men and three alleged co-conspirators this morning. The indictments alleged Pulowski and Vaughn used their offices for personal and political gain. They've accused, they're accused, that is, of taking part in elaborate pay-to-play schemes. Pulowski and Spencer essentially put a for sale sign up in front of City Hall in Reading and in Allentown to sell their office and their services to the highest bidder. Mayor Pulowski and former Mayor Spencer are facing several charges, including bribery and fraud. Eleven other defendants have already pleaded guilty in connection to this case. Tonight, Pulowski has vowed to fight those charges against him while staying on the job as mayor. Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Nieves joins us in Allentown with that part of our coverage. Alicia. Well, just the mayor of Allentown just a little while ago proclaimed that he is completely innocent, saying the only thing that he has done wrong was trust Michael Fleck. Now, Fleck ran his campaign and also ran the campaign of the former mayor of Reading. He is the one man that seems to connect these two mayors now accused of corruption. It's another case of corruption against public officials in Pennsylvania. This time, acting United States Attorney Louis Laplin just announced an indictment on the former mayor of Reading, Vaughn Spencer, and the current mayor of Allentown, Ed Pulowski. The indictments allege that the mayors repeatedly abused the trust of the citizens of Allentown and Reading. The two mayors are dealing with dozens of counts of bribery and fraud charges for allegedly trading city contracts in exchange for campaign funds. Pulowski and Spencer essentially put a for sale sign up in front of City Hall. The federal government has already taken down 11 people. Francis Doherty. Some are also former city officials. Mary Ellen Koval. All have already pled guilty to being involved in the web of corruption alleged against the two mayors. All of the alleged corruption in both of these indictments does serious damage to the integrity of our systems. We tried reaching the former mayor of Reading at his home, but no answer. And since part of his alleged scheme involved a former school district official, Rebecca Acosta, and an energy saving contract for the city schools, we reached out to the district. It says those contracts have since been rescinded. In Allentown, though, accused Mayor Ed Pulowski held a press conference. Integrity is incredibly important to me, and I hate that my integrity has been questioned. The Allentown mayor's news conference late this afternoon was met by a charged crowd of city citizens. I have done nothing wrong, nor have I ever personally accepted a dime beyond my salary as mayor. I have also never accepted anything but legal campaign contributions. And despite some city council members here in Allentown calling for the mayor to resign, he says he is not going to do that. In fact, he is going to continue with the campaign for re-election. Reporting live in Allentown, Alicia Nieves, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Alicia, thank you so much.